Let's begin in a child's pose. Separate your knees as wide as your mat. Bring your big toes together to touch and sink your hips back and down. Stretch your arms overhead and rest your forehead on the mat. Just begin to arrive. Let your body feel heavy and start to deepen your breath. Let your breath deepen. Let your body soften. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. And one more inhale and exhale. Slowly walk your hands to the right side. Maybe stack your left hand on top of the right. Keep your hips rooted down and breathe into your left side body. Walk the hands back to center. Then walk your hands over to the left. Take a few breaths here. Feel the opening in your right side body. Come back to center. Come up to tabletop. Press firmly through the hands and hover your knees just an inch off the mat. Inhale here. And exhale, downward facing dog. Lift your hips up and back. Push the mat away. Inhale. Soften your shoulders. Exhale. Send your tailbone high to the sky. Inhale. Relax your ankles to the mat. Exhale. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Inhale, plank. Tippy toe the back feet. Exhale, lower down to your belly. Inhale, cobra. Lift the chest as you pull the mat back. Exhale, lower back down, chest to the mat. Place your hands on the mat right by your shoulders. Inhale. Exhale, back to down dog. Send your hips up and back. Inhale, drive the right foot away, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Tap your nose to your kneecap. Inhale, back to three-legged dog. Drive the right leg up and away. Exhale, draw your right knee to your right tricep and then lean forward. Wide lunge. Set your right foot down outside of your right pinky finger. Inhale, gaze forward. And exhale, step your left foot forward to Malasana squat. Hip sink low. Hands at prayer. Press your elbows into your inner knees and your inner knees back into your elbows. Crow pose. Push your hands into the mat and lift your feet. Inhale, push through your palms and puff up your upper back. Then exhale, step or float back to Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Let the hips sink low and the heart open. Exhale, down dog. Lift up from the core and press back. Inhale, left leg to sky, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Push down to pull the knee up away from the floor. Inhale, three-legged dog. 
send the left leg back up to the sky. Exhale, pull your left knee to your left tricep and tippy toe your right foot. Wide lunge. Place your left foot to the outside edge of your left hand. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, come back to Malasana. Right foot steps forward. Toes wide, hips low, hands at prayer. Crow pose. Plant your hands, lean forward, and lift your feet. Take a deep inhale and puff up your upper back. Then exhale, step or float back to Chaturanga. Up dog. Inhale as you straighten the elbows. Exhale, down dog. Lift up from the core. Slowly make your way to a rag doll. Bend the knees deeply and grab for opposite elbows. Let the head be heavy so the spine can decompress. Breathe here. Roll up vertebra by vertebra and find Tadasana. Urdhva Hastasana. Inhale as you reach your arms tall, softening your shoulders down your back. Soften your knees and spill forward. Inhale up halfway, flat back, long spine. Exhale, left foot back to low lunge. Inhale, high lunge, arms to the sky. Relax the shoulders down. Exhale. Pull the right hip back. Left hip forward to square the hips to the front of the mat. Inhale. Superman. Exhale. Keep the arms by the ears and tilt the torso forward to 45 degrees. Breath in. Draw the arms back in line with the ears. Breath out. Maybe bring the torso a little closer to the front thigh. Inhale, pull the biceps back by the ears. Tilt forward a little more. Breathe out. One last inhale. Standing split. Exhale the hands down to the mat and lift the back leg high. Breath in. Keep pressing down through the standing foot and lifting the left heel even higher. Breath out. Fold a little deeper. One more breath in here. Exhale, forward fold. Bend the left knee in toward your nose and set the foot down next to the right. Inhale, halfway lift. Push your hands into your shins. Exhale, fold. Urdhva Hastasana. Inhale as you reach your arms tall, softening your shoulders down your back. Exhale and swan dive forward. Inhale to a halfway lift. Exhale and step your right foot back to a low lunge. Inhale, high lunge. Sweep the arms overhead. Deepen the lunge. Exhale. Square the hips to the front. Left hip pulls back. Inhale. Superman, keep the arms by the ears and exhale, tilt the torso forward. Lengthen chest forward, no rounding in the spine. Inhale. Tilt a little farther forward. Exhale. Draw the biceps back by the ears. Feel the shoulders heat up. Big breath in. Tilt farther forward. Breath out. Last breath in. Let the heat build. Standing split. Exhale, lower the hands to the mat. Back leg lifts high. Take a breath in here. Drive the right heel even higher. Let the breath out. Fold a little deeper toward the leg. Take one more breath in. Keep driving the right heel up. 
Exhale, forward fold, feet together. Inhale, halfway lift up. Exhale to fold. Inhale, circle sweep arms to sky, Urdhva Hastasana. Exhale, find Tadasana, stand tall. Utita Hasta. Inhale, float the left knee up toward the chest. Breathe out. Take hold of the big toe with your left piece fingers, right hand to hip. Stay here. Breathe in, or maybe extend your leg out all the way. Keep the torso upright. Slide the outer left hip down to even out the hips. Exhale. One more breath in. Keep straightening the lifted leg. Maybe lift it higher. Revolved Utita Hasa. Breath out. Grab the outside edge of your left foot with your right hand. Inhale. Stand tall. Lengthen the spine. Exhale. Twist left. Breath in. Float the left arm toward the back. Gaze beyond your left hand. Twist a little more. Exhale. Last inhale. Lift the heart. Tadasana, exhale, unwind, and release everything down. Utita Hasta, as you breathe in, raise the right knee high. Let the breath out and wrap your right piece fingers around your big toe, left hand to hip. Inhale and stay here or begin to straighten the leg out directly in front of you. Breath out, pull the right hip back to even out the hips. Last breath in here, lifted legs straight, maybe lifted higher. Revolved Utita Hasta. Exhale, take hold of the outside edge of your right foot with your left hand. Find more length through the spine as you inhale, stand tall. Rotate right to twist as you exhale, but keep the hips facing front. Inhale, reach the right arm toward the back of your mat and gaze beyond your right hand. Grow tall. Twist a little deeper as you exhale. Take another breath in. Energize the standing leg. Exhale, return to face front and release everything down to dasana. Figure four, chair pose. Cross the left foot over the right knee and take a deep breath in. Exhale, sink the hips back and down. Start to lower your chest toward your shin for flying pigeon. Root your hands onto the mat. Dig your left toes around your right tricep. Bend your elbows and push your chest forward. Maybe pick up your right toes. Maybe extend your right leg back. Exhale, draw your right knee in, sit your right foot down, and come back to figure four chair. Warrior three, left knee to chest, stand up tall, inhale. Exhale, sweep the left leg back and up, and wing the arms back for warrior three airplane. Breath in, find cobra with the upper body, lift the heart. Breath out, soften the gaze on a single point. Big inhale, get even longer from the crown of the head through the back heel. Low lunge, exhale, step your back foot way back. Push through your hands, inhale. Exhale, step the foot back, downward facing dog. Inhale, tippy toes. Bend your knees and make your way to the top of the mat. Inhale and lift halfway up. Exhale and fold forward. Inhale, circle sweep arms to sky, Urdhva Hastasana. Exhale, Tadasana, hands by the hips. Figure four, chair pose. Right foot crosses over the left knee. Inhale here. Exhale, sink back and down. Flying pigeon, second side. Bring your hands down to the mat. 
curl your right toes around your left tricep and start to go forward. Maybe pick up the left toes, maybe fly your left leg back. Exhale, pull your left knee in, set your left foot down, and come back to figure four chair. Warrior three, right knee to chest. Stand up, breath in. Exhale, right leg goes back long, arms wing back. Inhale, draw the shoulders back, open the chest. Shoulders melt away from the ears as you let the breath out. Stay for an inhale, yearn the heart forward even more. Low lunge. Exhale, step your lifted foot way back, gently landing on the mat, hands to the mat. Engage your core, inhale. Exhale, step back, downward facing dog. Easy seat. Lower your knees to the mat and bring your legs in front of you. Boat pose. Place the soles of your feet on the mat and extend your arms out long in front of you. Keep the spine long. Engage your core. Lean back and float your feet off the mat. As you inhale, straighten your legs so your body comes to a V-shape. Breath out to keep drawing the core in. Breath in. Stay lifted. Squeeze the legs together. Exhale, low boat. Curl your tailbone under. Bring your low back to the mat and hover your legs just above the ground. As you inhale, sweep the arms out overhead. Stretch them long by your ears. Just one breath out. Stay lifted, arms long. Being mindful of using your core strength rather than the momentum of the arms and legs, Inhale, back up to boat pose. Keep the spine long. Exhale, back down to half boat. Hover shoulders and feet. Roll up to easy seat. Hands rest on knees. Press the hands down and inhale. Lift your hips and feet off the mat. Lolasana. Exhale, Chaturanga. Push through the hands, lean forward, and shoot the feet to the back of the mat. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, shift forward to plank, shoulders over wrists. Exhale, and lower to the mat. Big Cobra. Walk your hands forward about a palm print in front of your shoulders and push your hips and legs firmly down into the mat. Inhale as you lift your chest off the mat, then drag the mat back with your hands to pull your chest forward a little more. Stay here, breath out. Inhale, push down to come up even higher. Roll shoulders back, exhale. Last time, inhale, push through the palms, chest comes up, then soften all the way down, exhale. Bound Locust Pose. Release your hands behind your back and interlace your hands. Press your hips into the ground, start to pull the fist back, and inhale as the chest pulls off the ground. And a deep breath out. Lift your fists away from your sit bones. Bend your elbows if that makes it easier. Big breath in. Gaze down, long spine, exhale. One more inhale, engage your back, rise up. And exhale, release the hands and come down. One more big cobra, hands in front of shoulders, hips and legs rooted into the mat. Inhale, push into the hands, lift the chest off the mat. Exhale, just stay here. 
Then inhale, push through the palms to lift your chest higher to the sky. Roll your shoulders back, exhale. Last breath in, push down and lift to your tallest cobra. And then exhale, soften all the way down. Plant your hands on the mat under your shoulders. Inhale. Exhale, back to down dog. Push back up. Make your way to a seat. Legs in front, knees bent. Draw the soles of your feet together and let your knees go wide. Bring your hands to your ankles. Wrap your hands around your feet. Then inhale as you sit up tall. Begin to hinge at the hips. Breathe out as you pull your chest forward straight out in front of you. Take a deep breath in as you lengthen your low back. Then exhale. Fold down over your legs. You can put your face toward your feet or your chest toward your feet. You can completely release and let gravity pull you deeper into the stretch in your inner thighs. Or you can keep lengthening on your inhales and pulling yourself further down on your exhales. Gently raise the chest back up. Draw your knees together and plant your feet on the mat. Reverse plank. Walk your hands behind you. Straighten your legs and inhale, lift your hips to the sky. Exhale, push through the hands. Slide your shoulders down away from your neck. Last breath in, lift the hips high. Exhale, slowly lower your legs back to the mat and roll down all the way onto your back. Plant your feet on your mat and let your knees point at the sky. Lift your legs straight up to the sky for a waterfall pose. If this doesn't feel very comfortable, feel free to find a wall nearby and prop your feet up on the wall so you don't have to hold your legs up. Relax the shoulders under you and turn your palms up. Feel your legs relax with the pull of gravity. Release the legs all the way down. Let the feet come to the mat. Happy baby. Draw both knees in wider than your rib cage. Reach for the outer feet or the hamstrings. And exhale as you pull on the legs, flattening your back against the mat. Relax into the floor for a moment. Draw both knees into your chest and squeeze them in tight. Take one last big breath in. Exhale, Shavasana. Lay the legs long. Let the arms come down by the hips. Turn the palms up and settle in.
start to deepen your breath. Come back into your body. Namaste.